This morning, Volusia County deputies swarmed a Daytona Beach neighborhood targeting a home they say was linked to an overdose death. West News Pamela Cohn caught up with the sheriff after one man was arrested. This yellow home in Daytona Beach was at the center of an investigation led by the Volusia County Sheriff's Office. Sheriff's Office, search warrant, open the door. Deputies showed up at Aberdeen Street and arrested 34-year-old Gerard Bennett Tuesday morning. Sheriff Mike Chitwood says this comes after a Port Orange woman overdosed on heroin. Bennett allegedly sold her. We had a hard time tracking down who she bought from because her cell phone was locked and nobody had the PIN number, so it took us a while to get in there. Once we got in there, we developed Bennett as a suspect. He was put under surveillance. The sheriff's office eventually obtained a search warrant, entered the home, and found over 30 grams of fentanyl and cocaine, as well as amphetamine pills. Sheriff Chitwood and his department are working diligently to get people like Bennett off the streets. We probably do 60 to 70 warrants a year, search warrants a year, just drug warrants. So that's going at their dealers right there. That's not counting the the street level operations or the car stop where the guy's got, you know, a pound of fentanyl or a pound of heroin in there. This work is partly to thank for the almost 20% reduction in overdose deaths across the county this year when compared to last. Reporting in Daytona Beach, Pamela Combe, WASH 2 News. Bennett is facing several drug charges. He's being held without bond.